Hey everyone, look, we are in day number 25 of the 30 day money game. And today we get to put $25,000 into our account and spend it. So my question is this, are you doing this? Are you having fun? How does it show up for you? Today is going to be completely different. We're going to work with our energy fields. We have had so many good responses. And I want to ask you, are you allowing yourself to have fun? Are you allowing yourself to spend this money? Or are you just carrying this old garbage around with you? Okay, because we can, we can, we can just go, oh, well, you know, and it's at this point too, that many people go, oh yeah, well, that was fun. And I don't need anything else. I'm not going to do anything else with it. And my question is, what would you do if you really had unlimited funds? Are there week-long seminars or workshops that you'd like to travel to? Are there people that you would like to send to workshops, but they just can't get away and they need the money to stay at home and all of that? Get creative. Start thinking about how you can help yourself and help other people. Now, today we're going to do something called EFT, which is Emotional Freedom Technique or tapping, and you may have heard of tapping. And what it does is it works with the meridians and the energy fields in our body. And this is what acupuncturists and acupressurists work with. We have energy fields running vertically and horizontally in our body. And where they meet, those are called meridians. And when we have energy and thoughts that, you know, kind of get feel yucky and they, they get stuck, they get stuck at those meridian points. So what we're going to do is to do several rounds of tapping and I'm going to show you how to do it. I'm going to do it with you so you don't have to worry about, you know, am I doing it wrong? You can't do it wrong, okay? But I want you to get quiet. I want you to take a deep breath and I'll show you how it works. We're going to do three setup statements with what is called the karate chop. And you can do it on either hand. It doesn't matter. But what you want to do is to take one hand as if you're doing a karate chop and you're lightly going to tap right here where the little pinky is and these are the statements that are even though and you'll repeat those after me and we'll we'll finish those up three of them and then we are going to tap right here on the inside of our eyebrows very lightly outside of our eyes on the temples underneath your eyes right here on uh, the space below where your nose is, on your chin, on your collarbones, underneath your arms and top of your heads. Okay? So we're just going to go ahead and you can tap along and say this, even if it doesn't particularly resonate like, well, that's not really my truth. I'm telling you, we're here as a group and there are people that it resonates with. And I'm going to say some things that will resonate with you. So we're not going to pick and choose. We're just going to do it. Okay? Okay, so take a deep breath and choose a hand and I want you to start tapping lightly and we're going to say this. Okay, even though I never felt really truly supported around money, even though I never felt really truly supported around money and I always had to fend for myself, always had to fend for myself, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though others in the money game, even though others in the money game are really making progress, are really making progress, and I don't feel like I am, and I don't feel like I am, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Keep tapping. Even though I struggle with money, even though I struggle with money, and I believe that ever-flowing abundance is not for me, that I believe that ever-flowing abundance is not for me, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Inside of your eyebrows, I'm not very good at this. I'm not very good at this. It's been hard to figure this out and find out what to do with my life. It's been hard to figure this out and find out what to do with my life. My background is making this harder than it ought to be. My background is making this harder than it ought to be. 
on your temples. It's hard to get in this feeling that I might be able to change my life. It's hard to get into this feeling that I might be able to change my life. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I've never been able to open up around money. I've never been able to open up around money. I don't like this feeling. I don't like this feeling under your eyes. Just saying this out loud makes me feel better. Just saying this out loud makes me feel better. On underneath your nose. Why did I think this 30-day money game was a good idea? <laughs> Why did I think this 30-day money game was a good idea? Maybe because I'm tired of the way life has been going. Maybe because I'm tired of the way this life has been going. On your chin. All this sadness and pain around money. All this sadness and pain around money. The world struggles with it, and I'm tired of it. The world struggles with it, and I'm tired of it. It's just too much. It's just too much. All this sadness and pain. All this sadness and pain on your collarbones right here. I'm ready to give up the struggle. I'm ready to give up the struggle. The struggle to be successful. The struggle to be successful. I'm ready to accept a new truth. I'm ready to accept a new truth. Underneath your arms. If other people can do it, so can I. If other people can do it, so can I. Maybe I can do this easily. Maybe I can do this easily. Nah. <laughs> Go ahead and say nah, because you know you're thinking it. <laughs> Top of your head. Okay, I'm going to stop messing around. Okay, then stop messing around. This is a golden opportunity for me to change my life. This is a golden opportunity for me to change my life and to change my money story and to change my money story inside of your eyebrows here. Reading and hearing other people's discoveries, reading and hearing other people's discoveries, their triumphs and their struggles, their triumphs and their struggles helps me feel better, helps me feel better. I don't feel quite alone. I don't feel quite alone. I'm seriously not going to keep doing things that make me feel awful. I'm seriously not going to keep doing things that make me feel awful. And those things in the past feel awful. And those things in the past feel awful. Underneath your eyes. Feeling good as I make this decision. Mm. Feeling good as I make this decision. And saying it out loud makes me feel so much better. And saying it out loud makes me feel so much better. Underneath your nose. This stuff that I've been struggling with. This stuff I've been struggling with. And dragging along, and dragging along, stops here. It stops here. I'm not doing it anymore. I'm not doing it anymore. On your chin. I have the power, and I feel it in my decision. I have the power, and I feel it in my decisions. I accept that I am worthy. I accept that I am worthy. I love this feeling. I love this feeling collarbones. These new decisions that I am worthy, these new decisions that I am worthy, and I feel abundant, and I feel abundant, and I am free to live a new life, and I am free to live a new life. These all feel so good. These all feel so good. Underneath your arms, my life is different now. My life is different now. I have fun with my life, I have fun with my life. I accept money joyously. I accept money joyously. I spend freely and I enjoy life. I spend freely and I enjoy life. Top of the head. All of this is true. All of this is true because I said so. Because I said so. And I love that about myself. And I love that about myself. Take in a deep breath. Mm. Doesn't that feel good? Just kind of circle your arms around. Just stir up the energy. Now, you can see and feel the difference in your body and in your mind by doing this type of technique, by releasing all those stuck places, by acknowledging how you have felt 
and taking in new decisions. Now I'm gonna give you a little bonus thing here that if you can't, if you're in a place and you just really can't do a whole round of tapping and all of that, <clears throat> find your thymus. Your thymus is like right here in your upper chest. And if you push around there, you can feel it. Sometimes you feel a little indentation and sometimes it just feels a little bit sore. And you can just take a deep breath and just tap that thymus, okay, at any time. And it says, uh, and say something like, I am feeling resistance in my body and mind. I'm feeling resistance in my body and mind. And I let it go. And I let it go. I am worthy. I am worthy. I am awake. I am awake. I am enough. I am enough. I have always been enough. I have always been enough. I am so enough, it's not even funny. I'm so enough, it's not even funny. And I love that about myself. And I love that about myself. So I'm inviting you to do this tapping, to practice it, to make up your own scripts that sound um, true to you. And go ahead and admit the truth. I mean, we all have this stuff in us. So we might as well get it out deeply and completely love and accept ourselves, tell how it feels, bring in the new feelings and the new decisions, and do and feel differently. So in this high state, I want you to bring in the energy that you've just stirred up. I want you to bring it into your heart and your mind. Thinking about your new changes, ramp it up, send it up through your heart and out. Boom. It imprints on the mind of God. You are affecting the quantum field, no doubt. Now let's bring this up for the people in our group and other people that we love, that we want to see get their heart's desires and feel better. Bring it in, ramp it up, ramp it up. Boom, send it out. So please share with me. Please share with all of us. Tell me what this brought up for you. Tomorrow we have $26,000. Don't give up on yourself, okay? You are right at the point where you're affecting the cellular level of your thoughts <clears throat> that drive this boat that we call our body and our mind, okay? So go after it. Have fun. Do your tapping and let me know what's going on. And I'll see you tomorrow, day 26.